Hey guys, it's Helen. How are you? Um, sorry for my voice. I sound crazy, but um, this is a little collab with um, Lori Sista and Holly World. I think it's 2001. I'm not sure, but I will um, look that up. But it's Holly and Lori, two sweet guys. So I will leave you um, their links to their channel down below, or not their channel, but their actual video, because we're doing a Fourth of July. Um, dessert. Um, so anyway, so far, this is all I got done and I am making a, um, um, yeah, I'm really tired, but <laughs> I'm making a dessert pizza. So I started with this and just stuck them on this baking pizza. This is a pizza baking pan and I got this from, um, for review. Um, and it came with a little pizza cutter too, so it's very cool. Um, so we're going to see how this works. That'll be my review. will be Because you could do cookies on it too. So anyway, once I'm just letting these um, get soft. And then I'm going to um, mold them all together like a pizza. And then um, we're just going to move the camera a little bit. Okay, and then I'm going to add half of it. I'm going to do fruit. You know, for the healthy sort. And then M&M's on the other side. Now, I thought that um, there would be M&M's for 4th of July, but I guess I'm wrong because I couldn't find them. Now, you can make a homemade um, topping for this, but who has time? So, we're just going to do frosting. Okay. So, I will be back once um, I squish all this down into, like, you know, a pizza. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um smash it all together. It didn't take long for them to get soft. Um, if I was doing this for a crowd, I would have done, I would have gotten more, but they only had that little bag. They didn't have the big long roll. And um, also what I wanted to say too is you could do this with the chocolate chip um, dough too. And if you get the roll, you just slice it and then you'd stick it all together and then mush it together once they softened up. So I'm going to put this in the oven and then I'll be back. Okay, guys, I have everything ready for the toppings. Uh, M&M's, strawberries, blueberries. Just washed them, dried them. And I don't know, seriously, I wonder sometimes if Kroger's, like, throwing fruit around in the fruit section and then sticking it in the, the containers. Some of this stuff looks ridiculous, but anyway. You can use any fruit you want. But I chose this just because of the colors. Really. And then our little trusty, I think everybody probably has one of these from the Dollar Tree. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, guys, it is out of the oven and cooling. So once it cools, I'll come back and um, we'll decorate it. Okay, guys, so this has cooled off enough for me to spread some frosting on there. Now, one thing I will tell you about this kind of frosting, you can actually put it in a mixer. And it almost like doubles in size. It gets a lot of air in there if you really need it. But with this little thing, we don't really need that. So I'm just going to spread this on like so. Hopefully I'll figure out how to speed this up on the video. My mother would be so mad that I'm using store-bought frosting. That's a no-no. Whoa. Are you guys still with me? <laughs> it's hard with this tripod up here. Okay. So that looks good. So now I'm just going to start putting some fruit on there. You can do it any way you want. There's no rhyme or reason for any of it. Especially for me, because I'm not fancy. If you cut a little too much fruit. Blueberries. So clearly this is the 4th of July part. 
I mean, you could make it, you could make this in a um, rectangle. You would need more um, dough. And you could do the whole flag. Okay, I'm going to have the other side <coughs> just some M&M's. Guys, if you go on Pinterest, there are so many ideas for this. Um, I don't know if you all are on Pinterest. I am on Pinterest. And um, I'll leave my link below. And if you're on it, please um, put your link or the name that you're on, and I will follow you. So really, it's really as simple as that. Okay? It's not a masterpiece, but it'll do. Okay, guys, as you can see, we have dug into this. It is really, really good. I recommend you guys try it. Have a good day, everybody. Ciao.